Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's recipe, I'm showing you guys how to make this quick and easy garlic mashed potato at home. If you guys would like to see it, keep on watching. It's very quick and it's absolutely delicious. Be sure to like the video for me if you enjoy it and let's get started. First thing you're going to want to do is wash your potatoes. I am using reset potatoes. Of course, you can use red potatoes, white potatoes, or any type of potatoes that you guys like. Now I'm using water and a scrubber to scrub the dirt off the potatoes. If you don't like the skin of the potatoes, of course, you can just peel them. But I like the skin, so I'm going to remove all of the dirt by scrubbing it and rinsing it really good. Once you are done, you're going to cut your potatoes into small or medium size cut. All right, now we have the potatoes nice and ready. We're going to get ready to boil it. Make sure to give it a wash before you add the water to it. Now I'm going to add the water in, add my salt, and we're going to cover the potatoes so they can boil, okay? Covering it will make your mashed potato come out nice and fluffy, okay? Once you're done boiling your potatoes, your potatoes are nice and fork tender, you're going to remove the hot water from the potato and we're going to mash the potato. Now I'm using a potato masher to just mash my potatoes down. I'm adding in garlic, salt and pepper, and melted butter, lots of melted butter because I like buttery potatoes. And of course, I am adding in some heavy cream. Later on, I'll be adding a little bit more of the heavy cream. If you like it creamy, of course you can add more, but just add all of your butter, salt, pepper, and then mix it together, mash it together. Also, I am going to be adding some fresh parsley in there as well for a more flavor type of potato. Just mash it down together. If you like it chunky, you just don't over mash it. But if you like it smooth, that is basically how you make homemade mash. It goes with pretty much any type of protein. And of course I ate mine with, with this beautiful ribs right there i have a recipe for that which i will link below for you guys if it's not there yet it will be uploaded but thank you for watching let me know how you make your garlic mash down below don't forget to give the video a thumbs up for me even though this recipe was super quick super easy but i know a lot of you guys might need help making mashed potato at home from scratch Thank you for watching. I'll see you all on the next recipe. Bye.